Hello everybody, <clears throat> time for another shave. Just gonna show you a razor. I'm not gonna use this razor today. This is an old uh, Bengal uh, with home scales. I just polished it up, tried to hone it a couple of days ago. Uh, it's a wedge, uh, full wedge as you can see, I think at least. Uh, it says somewhere here in the I don't know if you can see it. Sheffield, England, something more, and Bengal on the other side here. So it's an old razor at least. <coughs> I don't know, four, four, eight, maybe. I don't know. Tried to hold this bad boy up, didn't work so well. I can shave with it, but it's not sharp enough. So I'm gonna do a new try with it and see if I can do a shave this weekend. But I'm just gonna put this away. I just thought you can see it. Uh, so for today, that's the Oros Rock Tool. Really nice soap, in my opinion. Gonna finish with Race Rock Emperor because I want to feel, smell like an emperor today. And I'm using my two ball brush for emerald shaving supplies. And the razor of today is my uh, CV Helios Time NK number 32. I think this. It has been a, a sheep in this nose and they have shortened it a bit. So with this Avers colors, it's a nice razor, I think it's six eight something. And it works really great, I like it very much. So let's start to shave and see if it works. As good as I say. <laughs> yeah, I tried to hone that Bengal. Sorry. <laughs> um, razor. Don't remember if it was, yeah, it was yesterday actually, sorry. <laughs> uh, and uh, uh, it was sharp enough, it wasn't sharp enough. I have some problems with what razors to hone. These hollow razors, extra hollow razors. I often get really nice and sharp. Uh, new wedge, squat wedge, and half wedge. More difficult for me to hone, I don't know why. Maybe I'm using wrong stones, I don't know. Or the technique is not efficient enough. But someday, <clears throat> I hope I can get the hand of only all kinds of razors. Still a little bit snivelly. <clears throat> yeah, you know I have sent some razors to Frank Strandberg to test out some edges and some razors and uh, I have heard a little bit of the edges and uh, I think it's the same conclusion as I had you can shave with them the one uh, when I put your razor that's a brilliant edge it says it was a really nice razor to use, really nice edge, really sharp and smooth. The other razors, a little bit tuggy. I wonder if there was actually a little bit tuggy, lots of tug when you Try to go against the grain. And I know Frank Strandberg, his <laughs> YouTube channel, just a moment. <laughs> he 
He changed his YouTube channel just because he was trying out some edges I have done. <laughs> Call it Matt's Lab Rat uh, sh shaving channel or something like that. <laughs> I thought it was really fun. I think it's Matt's Lab Rat shaving. <laughs> Yeah, he's a really nice guy. I love to talk to him. Talked to me a couple of times. I met him in real life a couple of times. Uh, no, no, a couple of one time, and it was a really nice person to know. Talked to him at phone several times. Always have fun we talk. He's a really gentleman, and I appreciate appreciate very much his help. Help. I need to learn this honor skill more and more and if he wants to help me I'm really really glad and he's helping me a lot really much <clears throat> I'll tell people to give the honest opinion <clears throat> sorry I want to had the honest opinion, not some embedded bad words. You say it's something nice because you don't want to harm that person. Don't, don't, don't harm, but uh, get him to get a bad mood. You know what I'm, I am I can't explain it in Swedish. I can, but not in English. Uh, you always try to be nice to people. For instance, if I ask a person, what do you think about my t-shirt? I want your honest opinion. And he says, that's beautiful, but that's ah, beautiful, she says. It's better, he says. I don't like it. It's not ugly, <clears throat> but I don't like it. If you like it, wear it. That's an honest opinion. That's what you think in your, your um, heart. Don't have to put it in some fans words. Doesn't mean that you don't like me. Because if you don't like me, you don't want to hang around with me. And that's the same thing. Be honest to yourself, to others. You don't have to be a jerk. You can actually be honest to people. And respect people. And I respect people. That are honest and say what I think. But I don't like people think that they are better than other people. That's gonna rinse. <coughs> it's like here in Sweden, you know. Swedish cars, the Volvo and the Saab, two different kinds of cars, vehicles, and uh, sometimes some people say you drive a Volvo, you're not a nice guy, you have to drive a Saab, and vice versa, it doesn't matter what fucking car you use or drive, what kind of clothes you wear. What belief you have, as long as you can accept me, respect me, I will accept you, I respect you, but don't come talk shit about me and my family or my my things that I believe in. Uh, I can respect your honesty when you say I don't, for example, 
I don't trust in God or I don't uh, I'm a Jew or I don't uh, whatever it is it doesn't matter if you respect me I can respect your religion I can respect you whatever you do that's not a thing in my opinion at least I'm not going to talk about that anymore <laughs> thank you very much for watching everybody I hope you're going to have a beautiful upcoming weekend uh, I'm going to have a diving weekend this weekend and I try to as I told you before do a share with that razor and try to hold it tomorrow and see if I can managed to get a share with it in this weekend. So long everybody, have a great upcoming weekend. As I told you, don't be a jerk to people and have a great day. Bye bye.